Welcome to iTech Tutorial. To draw a hyperbola using locus method, the first step to take is to draw a horizontal thin chain line and a vertical thin continuous line intersecting at a point. I have already done this step. Now I will label the point where the lines intersect, G. Having done that, I will mark a point on the horizontal line and call that point, F. Point F is the focus of the parabola. Now I need to obtain the vertex which is point, V. In this video, I'm about to draw a curve of ratio 3 over 2. To obtain my vertex, I will divide line GF into 5 equal parts, that is 3 plus 2. V will be 2 divisions from G, because I'm about to draw a curve of ratio 3 over 2. The focus, F and the vertex, V have been obtained. Now I will draw vertical thin chain lines parallel to the directrix and intersecting the horizontal line I drew. The directrix is the vertical line I drew. This step can be done this way. The point where these thin lines intersect the horizontal lines should be called, H1, H2, H3, H4, and H5. The next step to take is to cut two arcs on the first thin dash line. To do this I will use my ruler to measure line GH1, then I will multiply the length I obtain from the measurement by the eccentricity. I'm using 3 over 2 as my eccentricity. Your eccentricity depends on how you want your hyperbola to look. Since 3 over 2 is equal to 1.5, I'm multiplying the length of GH1 by 1.5. This step can be done this way. I will repeat the same procedure for the second thin chain line but this time I will measure line GH2 and multiply it by my eccentricity which is 1.5. I will follow this pattern for the remaining chain lines. all of these steps, it is time to produce the curve. To produce the curve, I will use my French curve to draw a curve passing through V and all the arcs I cut on the thin chain lines. I have successfully completed the hyperbola using locus method. 
You can always follow these steps to draw any given hyperbola. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any question, you can drop it at the comment section. Please subscribe to this channel. Also let us know your opinion and how you feel about this video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you find it helpful. See you in my next video.